According to open source news media, that is open source intelligence information, Intel, Rashida Tlaib and Ilhan Omar have been banned by Israel from entering Israel for their upcoming entry that had been planned. Entrance banned. You know what, man? Good. Fucking good, man. I'm one Sir Grove OSGOE, host of this show. I am super proud of our president, Donald J. Trump, for being proactive. That is for having taken action and a step in the right direction. You know, man, these these haters of Israel are very hateful. They're just hateful people. And they think that by hating, it is somehow to their advantage. Well, apparently, Ilhan Omar and Rashida Tlaib, they're not going to be going to Israel as part of their planned trip that was uh, upcoming because that shit is over, man. They have been uh, shut the fuck down. Yeah. Yeah. And, uh, you know, man, what were they thinking anyway? I mean, Rashida Tlaib is on some type of ridiculous mission to impeach Donald Trump, which she can't do, which she won't do, which she doesn't have the power to do, which will never happen. So she's someone who's just spinning her wheels. She's a wheel spinner. Um, I mean... I'm not going to sit here and say she's delusional. Uh, She's definitely unrealistic and definitely counterproductive. I mean, if that's how she wants to spend her life on planet Earth as a loser, you know, because Donald Trump is a winner. And in my book, in my view, she's a fucking loser. And uh, the same with Ilhan Omar. Uh, Hating Israel. Okay, well, whatever, fucking loser. You know, in my book, Donald Trump's a winner. And, uh... Ilhan Omar in my book, she's another fucking loser, man. Just just doing dirty, you know, just in, involved in dirty politics. Hating on Israel, thinking that it's going to get her somewhere in life. Well, got her banned from Israel in terms of at least the upcoming trip that she had planned. So, I wonder how that fucking feels to be banned from Israel because you're an anti-Semitic. I mean, how does it feel to be an anti-Semitic? I mean, really, how does it fucking feel to just have so much hate for Israel? Yeah, does that help you now that you're banned from Israel for your upcoming trip? How's that for your reputation?